According to a U.S. government report, China appears to be unfairly dominating markets using its intellectual property laws. It says Beijing has strengthened patent and copyright laws to some extent, but adds it's not enforcing them or implementing them sufficiently. The report was released on Wednesday. In it, the U.S. trade representative said, China must provide a level playing field for intellectual property protection and enforcement. The report raised concerns about China's bad faith trademarks, counterfeiting, and online piracy. The report also created a priority watch list flagging countries for significant concerns over poor intellectual property protection. Seven countries made the list. Those are Argentina, Chile, China, India, Indonesia, Russia, and Venezuela. In the meantime, the U.S. Trade Representative's office is recognizing Taiwan for making strides to protect its trade secrets. The office named online piracy as a top concern. A special report keeps track of the protection of intellectual property and how that's being enforced between U.S. trading partners. The office noted efforts by Taiwan, the European Union, and Chile to step up their game in protecting trade secrets. To boost those goals, Taiwan's legislature made changes not too long ago to the island's intellectual property laws. What's more, according to manufacturers, the trade representative report shows there is concrete action taking place to protect innovation in the manufacturing industry. The National Association of Manufacturers issued a statement saying innovation and intellectual property are the lifeblood for manufacturing in the U.S. It went on to say, urge the U.S. trade representative and other agencies to stand up for innovative manufacturers by knocking down these barriers and by pushing back against those who would weaken critical intellectual property protections around the world. The number one institution in the U.S. Chamber of Commerce on intellectual property standards also weighed in on the report. The senior vice president said the governments have two options. They can either support systems that help people who have novel ideas get a fair shot at success, or they can roll back protections leading to less prosperity. He said the trade report shows that many countries still have far to go to ensure intellectual property rights.